I absolutely love the design of this watch here. You can see it's in the black and gold. Um, I take a picture of it. It light. It there's a luminous dials there. I take a picture of that tonight and show it to you as well. Um, it's made out of stainless steel, but coated with this gold coating. It has the sapphire glass, so I don't have to worry about any scratching. It's Japanese movement and clear, transparent back. Another nice feature I like about it. It's as you can see there, everything is clearly labeled along the sides, even the number of the watch and, and all of that. Um, it's water resistance to 5 ATM. It says that on the back as well. That means fifth, it measures, it measures it underwater for a brief second. And you can see the sparkle in there too. That looks really cool. Um, just really, really cool spark. It, it looks like the night sky. It, it's that cool. Um, yeah, the, the 5 ATM means a water resistance of atmospheres and it goes to 50 meters. Now that's only for a brief period of time and that's making sure your crown here is closed. Now look at the gem there on the crown, just really nice touches to that. Um, and you see the, it's, it, the design around the edges, the whole edges of it just looks so sharp, so professional. Um, and I, I like the black here on the uh, band as well, so you can see that. Um, and it shows up on both sides of it. Um, now, I do not swim with this. Um, I don't swim with it just because it's a luxury watch. But if I jump in the pool, I'm probably going to be okay, but I will get out and um, dry it off. <laughs> so, other than that, um, it, you know, and a 5 ATM is really, by today's standards for luxury watch, um, very good. Um, so, the watch is so comfortable to wear, it, I love the sapphire glass. I don't have to worry about scratching it. Um, I like the gems on it. You see the month, the day of the month as well. A um, little hard to see at various angles, as you can see when it's when it's going through the turn there. Um, the the watch itself is just really in a class by itself, um, and looks and the Japanese movement, the sapphire glass, and it it seems like it has a pretty good. Um, anti-reflectiveness as well. I'm outside here today, so you're probably getting some of the sun, maybe some of me in the thing, um, but it, it, you can always see the time when you glance down at it, which is really, really nice. Um, so just wanted to show it to you and um, let you see it here up close and um, very fond of it. Very easy to use clasp. Comes with the box. All these straps are adjustable. Um, you see here, um, they give you the tool to make the adjustments as well if you need to do that to make your band a little shorter. Um, so there it is, and there's plenty of length to it, so you'll probably need to shorten it. So if you have a bigger wrist, um, you'll be fine as well. So yeah, I just really like it, and I think it's just a high quality luxury watch. And if you watch the second hand move, it's kind of neat. It kind of, uh, I try to keep my phone real still here. Just like little increment movements, like a, a, a move and a stop. A very accurate, leave them, leave them fully, get in, in sync for, you know, like two days and, and then you're, you're fine. Um, so if, if it's off in the first two days, don't worry about it. Just reset it. And um, it just really, for the first time, kind of getting in sync for the first time. So this is automatic, means no battery. Um, so wear it often or, you know, you... Uh, you may need a watch winder as well, and they're always fun. So, all right, there's the watch. Just wanted to show it to you, describe it for you. I absolutely love it.